Hi guys, it's Nika again, and welcome back to my channel. And today I have a special guest. Yeah. Introduce yourself. Hi guys, my name is Tian, and I have a YouTube channel. It's called I Am Tian. We are filming a get ready with us video. And we are both makeup artists, and that's how we met. We met in makeup school, and we became good friends. And we decide to collaborate. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that's why we're yeah. friends. <laughs> Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and let's get started. First step: I always cry my face, no matter what. Me too. I'm priming my face with this Nivea um, aftershave ball. As a moisturizer. This is the best. I have a clean face, so um, just wash my face. I always mix my foundation because I can I can never find my skin tone, so I'm mixing Clinic, Clinix, <laughs> and Nars. These are my two of my favorites. So after my moisturizer, I'm gonna use this Skin Denivia. It's very good for um, oily skin. It's, it's a primer spray. So I'm gonna spray my face so that your makeup will last forever. I always. Mix my foundation with some of the moisturizer in there because I, I don't know because I find I'm more moisturizing. So you uh, wait a little bit for your primer spray spray to dry. <laughs> so for foundation, I'm using this uh, LA Girl Pro coverage foundation. It's really affordable. It's only ten bucks, and it is the color I'm using is um, new beige. You say you like it, right? I like it. It's very skin like. For ten bucks, you can't beat that. I got it for six bucks on. Um, what? Black Friday. Since this foundation is a little bit light, I mean a little bit dark, <laughs> I'm gonna mix it with um, the LA Girl Pro Coverage um, White Foundation to lighten it up a little bit. I feel like you're gonna be much faster than me, so I'm like, <gasps> For concealer, I'm using Kat Von D. I don't really like this one, honestly, because it's like very thick and dry. But I bought it, so. Probably good for people with oily skin, huh? Yeah. And more coverage, but I don't like like heavy stuff on my face. Have you tried that foundation? The Kat Von D foundation? Lock it? No, no. I tried it in Sephora, but like I think it's too thick and that's why I didn't get it. So what's your tips for man makeup? Don't wear makeup. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what about for the guys who want to wear makeup? What's your advice? Contact us. <laughs> we makeup artists so we can do your makeup. <laughs> And then I'm gonna set my face with Laura Mercier powder, my favorite. The technique of making your face look natural is uh, for men or in general is blending. So I'm gonna set my face with this Tony Moly um, setting powder. It's called oily, uh, oily oil paper powder face mix. Where did you get it? Online, eBay, all the way. Do you like it? I like it. It helps my um, oily skin. <laughs> oily skin. So you're gonna dust all over your face. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I like to blend my contour with a brush first and then beauty blender. Because I'm that extra. <laughs> <laughs> and then I use a beauty blender. Nose contour is a must. For Asia, because we don't have nose. <laughs> we just have two little holes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't mind my nose. I know, like some people, they do plastic surgeries, but for me, makeup does the trick. And then I'm gonna bronze up my face with this um, ColourPop bronzer called Carry On. Ooh, dip a little bit in here. <laughs> Even though it doesn't pick up anything, I don't like this kind of press. This product. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. Then I like to use contour. I mean, powder contour. All right, I'm on my brow already. I'm just my contour. <laughs> For brow, I'm using Mirabella. Is it called Mirabella? The brow pencil. I got it from the Ipsy bag when I went to the Ipsy event and I like it. Did you have this? Oh yeah, I do. Do you like it? Did you use it? I don't know. I don't... I'm not feeling it. Why? I feel like the color is kind of off with my oh, skin. Okay. This brush is really cool. It's the Japanese contour and highlight brush. 
I just got it today at Ulta and it's 20 bucks. If I finish before you today, I would be oh, no. very surprised. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go and snatch up my nose with this um, ColourPop sculpting stick in the color Bloom. B L O O M. And then I'm gonna use a wet sponge to blend it out. I spend the most time on my eyebrow because I can never match them on both sides. Like, this is my struggle. Like, hashtag first world problem. <laughs> hey, I did a pretty good job today. I have been obsessed with the Huda Beauty eyeshadow palette. Um, I bought it in 2016 when Sephora had their VIB sale. And since then, I've been using this nonstop. We used to went to a makeup school and we thought makeup is difficult uh, to do, but um, how do you feel after makeup school? You think it's help? I mean, makeup school helps, but it's not like, oh my god, it's so worth it, everybody should go, you know? What do you think? Save your money. <laughs> 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 you don't, you don't. Don't get into debt. That's true, but you don't think it's worth it. Um, I don't, especially for beauty makeup. I feel like makeup school is not really yeah. necessary. Yeah, I really think that self-taught is enough, and you can learn a lot more actually than makeup school. Is this how you do your eyebrow? Oh my God! <laughs> do you feel like a guy? They like girl with makeup or no makeup? I think, honestly, I think guys likes girls with no makeup makeup. Like, like you have makeup on, but you look so natural that guys think you don't have makeup on. Uh -huh. But somehow they just think that, wow, why is this girl so pretty? Uh -huh. That's the trick. Alrighty, I'm almost done with my makeup. I know it's very light, but... I'm done, honey. I'm done! You're done? Yep. Yeah. No, you're not. Look at me. Very natural, manly makeup. It doesn't have to like cover. You are serious? You're done? Mm -hmm. Actually, one last step. I need to set my face with this Urban Decay finishing spray. Mm. Smell not that bad. Scandinavia primer spray and setting spray much worth it. This is my favorite drugstore mascara. L'Oreal. L'Oreal Carbon Black. It's so black. Oh my god, I look good on camera, but in real life, no. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are you using for that? No. Oh, your lash is long. Thank you. You know when I was younger, I thought like if you cut your lashes, it will go longer. Oh yeah, don't ha don't try that trick. I if did. you have kids, please don't try that trick. <laughs> it's not true. But after I cut it, it doesn't grow back. Yeah, because it's not true. true. Bobby Brown, all time favorite. I dropped it on the floor one time, and I was like, I don't care, pick it up. <laughs> Keep using it. I like this brush for highlight actually. This is my favorite liquid lipstick brand. It's from Sephora. I'm done. Simple. Easy. Simple. Easy. Peasy. Breezy. Beautiful. Cover boy. Easy. Breezy. Peasy. Breezy. <laughs> beautiful. Cheesy. Cheesy. <laughs> cover girl. <laughs> Alright guys, this is our Get Ready With Us video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to subscribe to I am TN channel and the link will be down in the description box. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye! Thank you so much for watching. Bye!